Hi there, my name is Stefan. I'd like to give you a quick overview of the GIMP. It's the GNU Image Manipulation Program and it's free and open source software that you and your team or your company can use to do graphic design and graphic editing and the capabilities of the GIMP is on par with Photoshop. The big difference being that it's free. I'm going to work on one image and I'm going to show you these four things. How to scale, crop, add transparency and add text and I'll throw in a rounded border as a bonus. There we go. I'm going to crop out this character over here but before I do that let me just show you how quickly and easily you can zoom in and out on images in the GIMP. You can simply hold down control and scroll with the middle mouse button up and down to zoom in and out. And then you can move the image around and zoom on specific areas in the image to see more detail. Also, you can get back to your original zoom with the press of a button. I'm going to crop out this image. So let's get this guy on his own over here. I'm going to crop him out. There we go. Now I want to scale him slightly because I want to add a border around him and I want to add some text. So I'm going to just scale him up slightly and move him. Now I'm going to add some text but I want to add the text on a little block over here. So I'm going to add a block and at the moment I've got this set to rounded corners and that's why I get this nice rounded selection. I'm going to add a new layer and on that new layer I'm going to add the black for my text background. On top of that I'm going to add some white text. I'm going to call it Chef School and you'll see that the text doesn't quite fit in so I'm going to manip manipulate the text by making it slightly smaller and I'm going to lessen the distance between the two lines. There we go. So now I've got my text, but I, know I still want to see the guy's feet, so I'm going to add some transparency to this black bar by sliding it down over here. So now I can see his feet, I can clearly see my text, and as a last bonus I'm going to add a rounded border around this image. And there we go. I'm going to add another layer. I'm going to put solid black in there. I'm going to shrink the selection by three pixels. Delete it. And there we have our character with a nice text overlay around the border. And I'm just going to give it a white background just so you can see it. And I can move layers up and down. So I'm going to move the white layer to the background. And there we go. Now the text isn't all that visible, so I'm going to change the opacity, opacity on here slightly. There we go. I'm happy and I hope you're happy.